So how much huge money it is going to be saved by the government of India through induction of this first project. So that is the main motto to migrate this. Now justification you are clear. But during this process, who is paying the cost? The cost is being paid by especially old age who refrain themselves from the digitalization. They don't want to migrate themselves to the digital world. So now it has been already decided. There is no chances of reversal. Like Krishi bill, it will never be migrated. So what is available with us? We have to digitally upgrade ourselves through various media. My, as an entrepreneur trainer, fitness consultant, I had been making lot of video, thousands of video regarding fitness. I made hardly one or two regarding pension. But due to this, I switched over and I started making video to a sports because lot of people they were calling. It was not possible for me to everyone communicate one to one. Okay. So in my channel Living Happily, I have created more than 60 excluding video covering all the aspects of a sports. Here I will give you in brief. So what is the problem you are facing? First, Aspers requires the digitalization of people. So I will take a survey. How many people among us are comfortable with operating their email? Just raise the hand. This is interactive session. You are operating your email. Mm -hmm. Bhagwan sir? How many are not operating their email? Four person. Have you seen your pension slip? Hard copy? Earlier? You have seen? You have seen your hard copy? Almost all have seen yes, their hard copy of pension slip. You check from the back. Okay. No, no, on, online you have seen. So, as first requirement, first, they will give you message either on SMS or in their email. email. So, unless you are operating your email, you will not come to know. In SMS, lot of us spamming SMS every day coming, we are ignoring, we are deleting. Correct? Out of that, even in spam folder also, their user ID will come. So, first question, how to know that my account has already migrated? Because if it is migrated and if you are not coming to know, then the day will come, your pension will be stopped due to Lack of submission of life certificate, you have not completed PDB, pension data verification. Okay. So now the first requirement you have to get upgraded. Okay. So what is the first step? Just operate your email ID. Just start training yourself. You are having already email. Your email might have been registered at the bank or yes. not registered. Yes. It is already registered. Registered with record office? Yes. That is not sure. Not Already sure. registered? Yes. Not sure. Okay. So out of here, I think almost all are uh, from Air Force? Mm. Uh, except to, except. 100% Air Force. Ec no, Army. expert on Army. Army. So Air Force, I will start from zero level. What to do to increase our literacy? Air Force official site is there. In that one link is there. Air Veterans. Kindly click it. अगर सिस्टम होता तो यहां मैं दिखा भी देता अदरवाइज सिंपल एयर वेटरन साइट इज देयर इन दैट वन लिंक इज देयर लॉग इन अनलेस यू आर हैविंग लॉग इन इट विल नॉट लॉग इन यू हैव टू साइन अप साइन अप मींस क्रिएशन ऑफ यूजर आईडी एंड पासवर्ड दैट इज कॉल्ड साइन अप दिस फिलॉसफी इज ऑल ओवर डिजिटल वर्ल्ड ओके सो इन एयर वेटरन साइट यू हैव टू साइन अप व्हेनेवर यू आर साइनिंग अप they will ask some basic credential like service number, when is the uh, date of retirement, date of re-enrollment, like that thing they are asking. Just fill up those things. You can create, you can put your service number as a username and password you can create. After creating, there is a table in that you can update your Aadhaar card, PAN card, mobile number and email with DAV. Okay, till now almost Whenever you retired, that time email, mobile, Aadhaar, PAN, 
कॉन्सेप्ट माइट हैव नॉट बीन देयर करेक्ट तो फर्स्ट स्टेप आवर स्टार्ट बिकॉज ड्यूरिंग दिस माइग्रेशन डाटा इज टेस्ट फ्रॉम टू प्लेसेस फर्स्ट फ्रॉम आवर रिकॉर्ड ऑफिस सेकेंड फ्रॉम आवर प्रीवियस पीडीए मीन सीपीपीसी ओके तो अर्लियर सीपीपीसी फ्रॉम सीपीपीसी ओनली मिनिमम डाटा वॉज बींग टेकन नाउ ऑलमोस्ट ऑल द डाटा वॉट एवर बैंक हेड एवरीथिंग इज बींग माइग्रेटेड ओके बट स्टिल द रिकॉर्ड ऑफिस इज पेरेंट स्टिल पेरेंट फॉर अस we have to be get in touch they will not come to us so now touch point is only mobile number email that is the touch point for anyone okay so first work get it registered in dav i think everyone understood aadhar card pan card mobile number email four things has to be updated in air veterans site just google air veteran official site will come okay update those four things second check your email whether it is registered with your bank or not bank means home branch in home branch there will be two places where your mobile number and email id has to be registered for first registration every credit entry whenever you are taking even 100 rupees depositing that will deal with your saving account whenever you are transacting anything all the transaction through sms and email will come to your sms email transaction second whenever the pension transaction pension transaction usually takes only once in a month and twice as a da arrear unless there is some extra arrears are not coming okay so 14 times periodically comes through pension so you check it from pension sms is coming or not pension detail will have what is your basic what is your commutation what is da what is deduction the detail will come from bank from sbi sms uh, this bank sms will have only the final mm -hmm. value okay. this value is credited on so and so available balance is so and so okay so you have to ensure every month uh, still majority of us are not migrated so every month you must get four things two sms one from bank from S S sb account another from pension account that is created by cppc and two email okay if you have insured how can you insure you have to visit your pension paying branch home branch there you give an application kindly update my email id and mobile number so and so in my sb account and in my pension account also Okay, unless you are because many staffs are there, they don't differentiate. Even a staff, they don't differentiate that there are two separate portal. Okay, so both the places, if your data is updated, mobile number and this thing. Okay, then whenever migration takes place, it will be seamless for you. The ID will come, user ID, everything will come. Then your journey will start. Okay. so this is the just how it will take place because almost maximum of us is not migrated so we have sufficient time to know about a spouse okay once it is migrated then you will have a very little time okay so it is still just ensure those things next those who have not been migrated till this date means november month okay even october month already done so in the month of november also some of us might be picked up for migration you don't know we know but you might not be knowing this okay suddenly whatever presently it might have been paid during 27 28 it will not come okay if it is not coming and pension has started only on the last day of every month then you think that my pension is migrated okay that is the first indication beside those sms and email id they will have different narration that will have one wording pcd allahabad like that okay so can you repeat it again sir repeat it this this one <coughs> difference of uh, sms no. so different type of sms will come after migration the first indication the last day of the every month your pension will start getting credited the last day that is the first indication 
Till now, all PDA earlier it was being paid on 25, 26. Mm. Due to a sports induction, it was dragged up to second last date. Okay, by our previous PDA. Mm. But a sports team is always paying on the last day only. So that is the indication. Second, SMS. SMS will contain a sports team or PCDA. Prayagraj wording will be there. In whatever the SMS is coming from bank, earlier SBI itself was debiting and crediting. So SBI word was used to be there. Now the SMS will come, but that will have wording PCDA Prayagraj. Team Spurs. Team Spurs. Some of the things is done by Team Spurs, some of the PCDA Prayagraj. Both are same. Both same. It is internal. It is between Team PNB. Team PNB means PNB inside. You just compare whatever you were getting, what type of narration earlier. Now narration change. PCDA, Prayagraj, or of course wording has come. If it has started coming, means your pension is already migrated. But the thing is that early warning all are getting if you are not submitting your DST, your pension is required. Ah, now I will come to that point only. Okay. So this was the just overview of the course, how it will take. Okay. Now this is the 13th November. Usually we are supposed to submit before 30th November. Okay. So November pension is already through there is no doubt. Even you don't submit before 30th November, it will be through. Okay. The December pension and after what? It is? Postpradhan. 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 December and after what? Pension is in danger. Okay. So December pension is being processed on the second last week of the month. So through this, we already know that we have with our, actually I should not disclose this thing, but still it is matter of insight only. So up to 20th December also, if you are submitting, so that data will be included and processed and your pension will be through, seamless. Okay. So just leave it that before 30, I have to die, but I have to mm, just relax. Okay. Up to 22nd of December also, if you are submitting life certificate, then also it will be continued. And this year, through authenticated sources, I am telling, it is going to be in dragged. One month grace is going to be given. Essential. Recently, circular is going to come within one or two days. Because how much? Message so only five. So it is already underway. Lot of queues has been there. During Corona period, it was dragged up to 28 February. Okay, so government is not going to lose anything by dragging. So this month also. But we should not wait for that day. Okay, if it is possible. For being disciplined pensioner, I will request you must visit to your PDA in the first week itself every month. This is matter of self-discipline. I should submit life certificate in the first week of every November, not to drag. That is called our financial discipline. Okay. Now I will talk to life certificate. Those who ever have not been migrated till now. So there is no matter of cures. Just relax inside. Let it be fire outside. Okay. Just visit to the branch. Whatever you had been doing, just continue. Submit the life certificate. I will request whoever is visiting to the branch for <coughs> life certificate. Just insist to the branch that they should give acknowledgement. Computer generated. Usually we submit a form. And that counter file they are giving. Okay. And later on that form is kept here. And that is not submitted. And many times many errors occurs. Even for bankers also. And for you problem occurs. For family pensioner. Many cases we have seen. The husband has acquired 10 years back. In Bangalore I should not quote the name. 10 years back husband has acquired. Regular pension is still coming. In Marathali area. Continue coming. Now one intelligent banker, hmm? how? This Muthu Swami, this lady, how? No, he has just five, ten years back. <laughs> now what is the problem? The rate of family pension and the rate of regular pension, 
it has margin of 40 percent the lady whatever amount she used to get she consumed all the amount if you ask 10 years into 40 percent whatever she got including da is it possible to recover it is amounting more than 10 lakh from one widow that might be only single source of income of that pension so how much we are facing even we are facing that problem that happens due to she is giving he is giving i am just keeping here i will do one day oh 30 november oh mm. Mm. i will wake up on 30 okay okay i will not check that is the wrong practice whenever pensioner is coming i should do immediately t plus zero second whenever i am getting the form i should submit and system will generate acknowledgement slip so you should insist if you are visiting to the branch sir kindly give me system generated i don't believe on this counter five business if you are telling me to sit i will sit for five minutes ten minutes or else you put their charter how much time you require i want computer generated slip i don't believe on this stamp okay once it is computer generated means take granted that it is submitted in cdc server there is no chances of any lapses okay so first case we get to the branch if your home branch is nearby second if you are digitally aware you can do it there are many means the first means is jeevan praman for jeevan praman it is the project of government of india for the last 10 years across the pensioner not only for defense pensioner it is covering all the even eps they are getting only 800 per month pension but still it is providing jeevan praman is a portal which is giving the just authentication that yes, if he is authenticated by you, you have to accept. But there also, I will tell you what is the clutch. If you are giving life certificate through Jeevan Praman, so one form is generated. So see the difference. That form is called acknowledgement, not certificate. That is acknowledgement. What is acknowledgement? Your life certificate has been taken in life this Jeevan Praman portal Jeevan Praman is not going to do anything with that that is only interfacing Jeevan Praman will capture your credential and verify with the Aadhaar and it will take that data to the PDA and not Jeevan Praman will not take it is the task of PDA they are doing closure of every day our CDC is doing they will take from Jeevan Praman every day daily basis they are taking from their repository okay they will not take repository uh, your jeevan praman if there is some error means after verification only they are taking so presently what happens you are doing jeevan praman okay only your account is migrated okay after migration in a sports the ppo number gets changed PDA gets changed, but in the default, whatever the last year you have filled, same data will be fetched and you are putting, Jeevan Praman is not knowing that your pension account is migrated, that is not the role of Jeevan Praman, it is your role, you should intimate Jeevan Praman that now I am going to get pension from so and so, there is a facility, add new PPO in the Jeevan Praman, whenever we are doing through that, so we have to add a new PPO. Once you are going for new, adding new PPO, all the data will be blank, whatever the bar being fetched. Okay. So after getting blank a screen, you have to feed everything. Means four data. First data, what is the category? The category is service for regular. For regular, our category is service. For family, it is family or dependent or disability, whatever the case might be. Second, after migration, who is going to sanction? So sanctioning authority is also changed. Earlier it was used to be for Air Force JCDA New Delhi, for Navy JCDA Mumbai. Now for everybody, only PCDA Prayagraj is our pension sanctioning authority. Next, what is the category? So category is defense Prayagraj. Again, who is the PDA? So during due to this of course what has majorly changed the pda role is taken over by the sports 
that is the change so there also two entry we have to change it pcds post pcds post so if you are changing if you are able to change during g1 praman especially for migrated people then that will be through that is the only for that region every things are being rejected okay because old data it will fetch old, old data you are doing you are taking <coughs> so what you have to do even you are doing okay so that is the only acknowledgement is generated that time it will have your photo the photo that was taken during biometrics of aadhar creation 10 years 20 years that photo is coming in acknowledgement okay it will contain that acknowledgement later will contain one praman id after 24 hours use that praman id and visit g1 praman portal in that g1 praman a status checking is there just put it put otp whatever the registered mobile is there otp will come you just put it they will display in that it will look like acknowledgement only but that is called life certificate life certificate that will contain bottom to line your life certificate has been taken over by a spouse or bank or whatever the bottom to line is changed whenever you are getting that type that it is taken by so and so then only take granted that my life certificate is submitted at the correct place but most of us what they are doing just having that knowledge yes, i have done it i have done it no. they are not going for the second place but also message also coming but from that after the uh, two three days message also coming with the your successfully yes. completed or failed whatever no, the case no, no, might be one doubt I have this one. This another one is there. Mm. The certificate also there. This on the side is there. What is the bottom two line? This one. Okay. Just mark the one. Nice. Not there. Line. It is not the there. Bottom two. Said, it is line. bottom two line. It is not there. No, no, sir. It is. It is not set. It is not only first part. It is. No, from our ID. No, that's right. It is only Praman ID is given, sir. No, no. This is no, no, no. In that, sir, in that second certificate, what you have downloaded? Okay, okay, okay. I will tell you, sir. Your migrated case. I will tell you. The two phase that I told you, the first confirmation. Leave it, sir. I got, I got your point. So first confirmation from G1 Praman. Okay. After 24 hours, they are uploading. Okay. Whether rejected or accepted. Second confirmation. It should be your task. to get confirmation from your pda ah. so as of now our pda migrated people pda has become a sparse mm. so sparse is giving a portal in that as of now it is taking more than fortnight mm. okay okay more than fortnight they are updating okay in the sbi whatever whoever is legacy system you are following you just go after 24 hours sbi pension seva portal they will update exactly next day if you are doing today tonight 12 o'clock yeah, yeah. next next day in sbi pension seva portal it will appear that your life certificate was submitted on so and so so you have to confirm from both the end from jeevan parman if you are doing so one jeevan parman second from pd okay so this is the one way getting the life certificate submitted first through branch that we have been doing second jeevan praman even jeevan praman has got many tools to be done this we were talking regarding the biometric device finger scanner or iris scanner was required then only you can do it the second thing it is done done through a sports uh, this android phone only face 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 recognition 